We've got one guy Takase! that weighs. Daiju! Daiju Takase weighs 169 pounds. Emmanuel Yarborough weighs in excess of 600 pounds. God. Now I don't have I don't have my 83 when I weigh 310 kilograms. Wow. Now you don't want to have this guy mounted or side mounted on you. No, I and I, no, I think what I do, uh, must go for is like I think or a triangle choke, or maybe you should squeeze him between his legs so he gives up. Daiju's got to use movement. Is what he's got to use. Oh, this is what he needs. He's, he's running gotta, away. <laughs> he's got to use movement, even if it looks frustrating to the crowd. He's got to use movement and kicks to the legs. Kicks to the legs. At the knee. Oh yes. Don't even go for a kick to the thigh. Oh no, no, I don't even go for. Oh, a kick to the thigh could go, but kick to the body, forget about it. Punching. Like, man, you you cannot even kill this guy with a samurai sword if you stab him. He's too big. You don't even want to go over to the body. Uh, Emmanuel Yarborough had a classic match with Keith Hackney. Oh, body shot. This uh, is a good place for maybe a jump spinning heel kick. Yeah, it's like a sort of a flying triangle. Flying triangle. <laughs> My God. I mean, what do you do? Whoa. See? You don't even, even want to let this guy catch you. Whoa. Oh, he's going for an overhand left. He can't get too brave, though. He's got to stay away from Yarborough. He's got to let Yarborough get tired. Wow. Whoa. This is funny. This is really tough. I, I'm glad that they don't have a fire drill. <laughs> oh, he's running for his life. Yarborough, Yarborough has slowed significantly. Oh, no. Yarborough... He's throwing his mouthpiece out. This is not a very smart thing to do. No, no. Of course, John Yarborough, probably the largest athlete ever to compete in sports in any event in the history of the earth that I know about. I mean, I know Andre the Giant was bigger than, than uh, Emmanuel Yarborough as far as height. Whoa. Whoa. Emmanuel Yarborough hustling now. I'm telling you it's... Oh, this is not good. Oh. You got a big avalanche of a man like that coming oh. after you. Oh. Can you imagine he mounts you and he punches you? No, I can't. I, I would probably tap as soon as he mounted me. Oh, yeah. I would freak out. Especially if I, you know... Takase is now fearing for his life. That, that was some energy throwing there. He should, uh, suddenly he should shock him and run the other side. Yarbrough the exploded there for a second. He almost grabbed Takase. And if, it, if he gets into a clinch, this fight is definitely going to be over. If he grabs him and doesn't let go, Takase is going to be in a world of trouble. Oh, until now, it's been a very <laughs> interesting if match. If I were Takase, I would jump up on the... No! Don't go for oh, oh, oh. you got to be out of your mind! He nearly broke his neck. No! This is horrible. This is like... This is like Jaws. This is like Jaws. <laughs> this is like Jaws. Where Robert Shaw was sliding off the boat into the jaws of the shark. This is the exact same thing. You've got this huge behemoth. If he gets on top of Takase, it's going to be harmful. It will be harmful. He's got to get out of there, fight for his life. The armbar is going to drive the armbar in. He can't go for an armbar. It's heading down. He's crazy. He's got to get out of there. Pull one foot out and then kick yourself out. That's what you should do. Oh one my. foot and kick him in the side or something. This is like a horror movie. Anywhere. This is... This is like... 
the sludge of Titans. I don't know. Look at that. Oh, that hurts. He, he's got to get out of there. <laughs> I've trying, never seen something trying, like this. Look at him. Well, Manuel, he's just hit him bleeding. He's going to hit him in the face. He's bleeding. Manuel Yarbrough gets out. No kill! Oh, no kill! Hey, hey, oh, my God! Hey. Oh, my God! He tapped out! Unbelievable! Whoa! Oh, oh my God! 83 pounds yeah, difference! Oh, my God! Daiju Takase has beaten the behemoth Emmanuel Yarbrough with strikes. He was in utter danger there.